I love you. Haven't you lost enough people today? I'm sorry. to pilot one of these new orders just in jensen the boss wants pritchard to examine the typhoon asap copy that thanks for the lift no problem hey and uh jensen i just wanted to say new look suits you like you haven't missed a beat at all thanks so how's it feel being augmented. Excuse me? Don't take it the wrong way. I mean, I've got a few neuro enhancements myself. Discreet ones to help me fly better. But I chose to get them implanted. You didn't. Now that you had a chance to try them out, what do you think? I think people should stop asking me so many questions. <laughs> they come in handy today, but still I didn't choose to get augmented. Today felt good. Surprisingly good. I'm not gonna lie and say they didn't come in handy back there. But like you said, I didn't choose to get augmented. So it'll take some getting used to. I get it. But don't be surprised if the boss keeps pushing you to get more. Why? What do you mean? You know how he is. He thinks augmentations are the be-all, end-all of everything. And he can't understand why someone wouldn't want to become more than human. Megan used to say the same thing. I'm not surprised. The research she was doing was pretty damn inspired. Might have convinced a lot more people to give what we make here a try. If... If that bastard hadn't killed her. Listen, Jensen, So they killed her. I know you want to find the men who attacked us, and so do I. If I can help in any way, all you gotta do is ask. Actually, there is something. I want to know about the first attack. Fine. Ask away. Malik's account. Oh. Okay, you were there. You were there that night. What do you remember about it? That it was chaos. First, everybody figured there'd been some kind of accident, but Pritchard couldn't get a good visual and communications were haywire. Then we heard the explosions. By the time anyone knew what had hit us... They were gone. Whoever they were, they were good, Jensen. Special training good. Did anyone else see them? The men who attacked? Not well enough to get a description. Pritchard got some fuzzy images off one of the IntelliCams, but his tapes were all confiscated by Homeland Security. Homeland? I heard Homicide passed it over to Special Investigations. Detroit Special Investigations. They did. For the first month. After that... All I really know is, the case is still pending. And Mr. Seraf is not pleased. I've been thinking about why they attacked. What they were really after. Isn't it obvious? They didn't want us going to Washington. No, that was just timing. Hearings can be rescheduled. Somebody else can present Megan's findings. I don't think so, Jensen. They took out her whole team. Declan Faraday, Vasily Sevchenko, Nia Colvin, even Eric Koss. The labs their bodies were found in. Were burned to a crisp. I know. The only reason you weren't caught in the fire was because that retaining wall came down. Saved your life, believe it or not. So the whole attack... 
Or it's just to destroy Megan's research. Sure looks that way. Mr. Seraph is hoping to reconstruct it, but it may take months. If he can keep us solvent that long. I'm gonna find him, Malik. One way or another. I believe you. And just so you know, when you do, I've got your back. I appreciate that, Malik, but right now... You've got to get the Typhoon into the tech lab, right. See you later, then. Oh, and Jensen, the boss wants a face-to-face -face debrief in his office once it's secure. Roger that. Good night, Malik. Give the Typhoon to Pritchard. Okay, so... Yeah. I did change the uh, field of view also. I uh, The um, default is 75 and the last, uh, the first videos, it was uh, 80, right? I did mention that. I, and now I have put it to, to uh, 90. I did try at 100, but I think it's too much. L let me show you. See, you can see a ton, but I'm afraid because uh, some people suffer of uh, motion blur and uh, I even get dizzy myself a little bit and I don't suffer of it. So uh, you still see a lot more, but everything is very, very small. And I'm afraid that when you talk, let's talk with someone. I think it's going to be smaller. What's your take on this, Adam? Two Not attacks really. in six months? Can't be a coincidence. Uh... Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave it at 90. Let me know in the in the comments. I'm recording ahead. I always record ahead of a schedule, but I, I'm trying to record a lot because I'm gonna start playing Atomic Heart when it comes out, uh, and probably I will have some. I want to have some videos of this by then. But uh, if you let me know in the comments, it always helps. See, so I didn't change anything else. We still have the reticle. The aim assist is off. I don't like uh, to have a. Uh, the robots helping me shoot this I took it off because otherwise over everywhere it tells you uh, cover here you know I can cover I know I can cover but otherwise it would show everywhere <laughs> I think it's uh, yeah I think a 90 is, is fine if it's can too you much those fanatics I mean they think taking hostages will get augmentations banned yeah no. um I think it's alright like this. Another attack? Can't wait to see what the humanity front says about it this time. This whole situation is gonna hurt us, Adam. If it keeps up, the UN is likely to rule in favor of industry regulation. And that will be the end of Seraph Industries. You, know, you are so smart, why is you a janitor? Oh? This game really, really, I, I said this a million times, but it's really... Where does this go? I don't know if the first... Uh, the first uh, playthrough that I did, if I ever found this. Let's hack it. Oh, the security rating, five. We only have two attempts. Look at that, five, three. Um, holy cow. Now, I have this, uh, the nuke virus and all that, but I mean, I'm not gonna use it right now that we are friends with everybody. I can try it, we have two tries. Fifty-five. 55% detection, detection chance. Wow. Okay, there we got 300 credits. I don't really care about the credits. 200 credits, that's nothing. I want to get through. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. And we take 300 credits. I don't really care about the 300 credits. Ah, the only thing is that this one clearance. But this one is very high. 
Um, okay, let me see if I can. Let's see if we can get this. We did. Level 5. This is level 2. 15% chance. Okay. Alright. Look at that. This is now 0. 0% 0 detection chance. Boom. Alright. And this is 0 also. This is 1. I think I can do it. I don't know how many seconds I will have. Maybe I try... Mm, this is 75, huh? But this is mine. So it's level 5. It's going to take uh, some time to go there. If it hits me here, then they know where we are. Uh, okay, let's go. Wow, this is zero now. Hours. There are the credits. Let's spam this. That's minus one for him. There are no more, no more uh, rewards. So let's get it open. Access granted. Thank you. So where, where is this? Oh shoot! It doesn't go anywhere. So we. Ammo. Oh, do I still have everything that... Oh, I do. Okay, I'm hoping... What is this? Ammo capacity upgrade. Oh, I can put that in a weapon. Combine. I can choose which uh, weapon to... Let me see. Extended magazine upgrade modification for weapons. Add a few bullets to the weapons magazine. The extended magazine upgrade replaces a weapon system ammunition magazine with a larger, greater capacity version. Total up, da da You can put it combined with what? Okay. Okay. Cool. The weapons is, is very cool because in the original game, if you haven't played it, uh, Deus Ex. Uh, the, from year 2000. The, the tele, 10 millimeter pistol was there. <laughs> I don't know if all the other weapons, I guess it is. So all the weapons are the, the same. But this is pretty cool. Let me save. Uh, no, but it was uh, worth it to, to check around, right? Uh, I said a million times, it really rewards exploration, this, uh, the Deus Ex games. I did try the. Um, Ah? Where are we? This can be useful later. I mean, I don't remember. If you haven't played the, the game, I don't want to... Ex spoil things because well, it's been eight years since I played so th there's stuff that I, I don't remember myself but I know that we're gonna have to get into the uh, into the building uh, to find the stuff so all this is gonna be useful later where the f-bomb are you b-dog brandy needs that nopoth it ain't like aspirin. People can die if they don't uh, hold off taking aspirin. You got 50 minutes more to meet me behind the gas stat station. Uh, then I'm going as well for help. Don't let me down, dude, please. What is this for? Well, uh, which way? This way. So this is, this is, these are drugs. These are the drugs that... Uh, we, ah. But we can't uh, grab them. 
Okay, anyway. Close that. Oh, this is to go to the helipad, right? So let's go upstairs. Here is the cafeteria. Lobby, technology lab. Who are you? Can someone tell me how the purists were even able to break into the plant? We're supposed to have state-of-the-art security measures here. Uh, yeah. We're supposed to. A lot of things. Sometimes the, the, the frame... I uh, know the, the the image stutters a little bit. I'm hoping that everything that I that I grab with David Serap in person to offer my deepest sympathies and assure him that these attacks are in no way linked to Humanity Front. My people have worked tirelessly to find a peaceful solution to this dispute, and I unequivocally <laughs> turn it off. Picus TV. So when we go to the next mission, wherever that is, I'm hoping that I can take... Uh, oh, I thought there were... We did grab a beer here before, right? I think. Who are you? Adam, I heard you were back, but I just didn't believe it. Gosh, you look good. Thank you. And I'm single. Hey, Jensen, heard about what happened in Milwaukee Junction tonight. Hey, this guy is looks like the SWAT. Really after the typhoon? He looks like the SWAT uh, guy. There, yeah. I already talked with you guys. Okay, let's go see Pritchard. Okay, so now if we go here, there it is. Tying up loose ends. Give the Typhoon to Pritchard before I hand it. I hand him my full report. Sharif wants to make sure the Typhoon hasn't been damaged. Pritchard can examine it in the la tech lab once I talk to him. Okay, let's go. And then I'm gonna break in in all the offices. I'm gonna hack all the computers. <laughs> I'm gonna steal all the credits that I can find. Do you have anything else? Maybe I missed. Oh, look at that. A new uh, oh, software. Give me. Thank you. Don't mind me. I already took your credits from there. And he had a, an ebook. Well, we already took that. Okay. Yeah, this one. We already read it. Oh! Another chocolate bar that gives us uh, extra energy. Okay. Uh... Well, if it isn't Mahatma Gandhi himself, come to honor us all with his life preserving presence. If this is about the typhoon, I'll get to it in a minute. Now, Pritchard. I didn't risk my neck to have you lose it in a pile of CPUs and SCSI adapters. Well, look at you, using the big words. <laughs> Don't think just because you hacked through the plant security system so fast that you're an expert on everything computer. There's a reason I can't examine the Typhoon yet. Do tell. For your information, I am running a diagnostic sweep on our network and router security to find out how Sanders Hacker got a hold of our codes. I'd have thought the first question to ask is, whose codes were they? Unless... You already know. Stick to kicking down doors and shooting people, Jensen, and stop trying to do my job. I didn't shoot anyone. I guarantee you will get along better that way. Give that a typhoon. Okay, we got a thousand XP. Now, the thing is that... What are you going to do with the typhoon? So now we don't have it again. Meet with Sharif at the penthouse. Uh... Yeah, we don't have it. Because we have it in our augmentations, we do have the Typhoon. Where is it though? I don't I don't remember again. Oh, Typhoon Explosive System. Here it is. I have it upgraded to the max. Oh, we have three Praxis now. And I don't know where I'm going to use it for. Maybe for this. A stealth Enhancer. Uh, so we can mark and track targets as a, at a distance which if we're gonna do I'm gonna try to go ghost and only fight the, the bosses I don't know if we will be able to to do it but uh, well 
For sure they are gonna they are gonna detect me somewhere. I'm gonna have some fighting, but uh, as long as possible to get more more XP. So the penthouse. We need to go to that. Uh, the elevator. David and you, Daryl. Hell if I know. Right. What did Bill Gates and Steve Jobs talk about? I bet Where are you? You looking for something, Jensen? I think Pritchard's in the tech lab. I bet he's trying to convince him to come out of hiding and make a statement that will counteract Bill Taggart. Darrow is not. Hey, hey, hey! Look who's back! I heard you were healing really fast. Congratulations, man. Darrow is not hiding. Thank you. He's working day and night in the Arctic, trying Where are you? to save the world. That's what millionaires do. Wow! When they get bored. Didn't expect to see you back so soon, Mr. Jensen. Didn't you know that? I heard you were nearly a goner. I'm not. Lobby offices, offices, health and fitness. Research and development, under construction, marketing, under construction. Legal, human resources, accounting and purchasing, and yeah. the penthouse. Me. Still Here the we office. go. Things are just starting to calm down. I didn't go to my office yet. So, we are, this is Detroit, right? We are in Detroit. I'm telling you, Hugh, he might not have put the gun in Sanders' hand, but it was Taggart's speech to the UN that started all this. William Taggart is nothing if not a shrewd political operator. You know that, David. So for the sake of appearances, I have to look him in the eye and let him bullshit me? With a smile. <laughs> Always with a smile. I bet you... Oh, oh. We'll all, talk later. All these guys are involved. There was a meeting at the right at the beginning of the game, me? right? Yeah. How you feeling? I've had better days. Well, when we're done here, check him with Dr. Markovic at the Limb Clinic downtown. Came here to get a checkup. If you insist. Listen, about Sanders. Yeah, about Sanders. What the hell were you thinking? Letting him slip away like that? I sent you in there to take care of things. I'm hoping it will pay off later. Sanders won't rest until he learns who set him up. Sanders isn't the mastermind behind this boss. And I did. The Typhoon is safe. Sanders didn't know about it. He didn't even know his hacker was augmented. He's not the mastermind behind this, boss. So you cut him a break? The man broke into my facility and took hostages at him. I thought you were ready for this. I am. Today's attack was just a shell game being run by somebody else. I intend to find out who and why so that it never happens to anybody again. Good, because so do I. That hacker in Sanders' group, you're sure he was augmented? I pulled his cables out myself. Yeah, well, the police are saying he's not, and they're refusing to let me see the body, no matter how much money I threaten to pull from their retirement fund. What? I mean, you should have uh, uh, those glasses, uh, so <laughs> high-tech stuff. Couldn't take a picture of the uh, of the guy. Well, maybe they didn't like being held off so long at the plant. Maybe someone else is offering more. Maybe someone else is offering more. So what do you want me to do, boss? We have to get a look at the corpse. You still got friends in the force? You think, uh... You think one of them will let you into the morgue? Depends who I run into. Get over to the station and find a way inside. Because if that hacker was augmented, his neural hub might tell us who he was. Contact me when you've gotten a hold of it. Boss, what you're asking me to do is not exactly clear. You got it. You got it. Okay. More XP, more XP, a ton of XP. That hacker's not gonna be sitting still for long. Get over to the station and find a way inside. Okay. Anything else? Don't forget to check in with Dr. Markovic at the Second Avenue Limb Clinic. I need you in top shape for this. Don't forget to check in with Dr. Okay, Markovic okay. at the second avenue. Don't repeat yourself. Don't repeat yourself. 
You look like a robot. Which way do I have to go? Can I go this way? Not this time. Can I turn off your computer? So you support the Detroit... How are they called? Detroit... Tigers. Is it the Tigers? I'm not much into baseball these days. I think it's the Tigers. I follow the Toronto Blue Jays. Yeah. When I was in Canada, 1992, they went to the Super Bowl. What? They, they won it, right? Yeah, yeah, they won the World Series. What the heck? Hello. Adam, were you just speaking to David? I didn't know he'd finished his call. Is everything okay? As well as can be expected. Right, like I know what that means anymore. The phone's been ringing off the hook ever since Bill Taggart's little press conference this evening. Taggart. Seraph was speaking about him when I walked in. What's the founder of the Humanity Front saying about us now? Oh, he's all sincere this time. Denouncing <laughs> all the violence that's been committed against us, offering to come here in person to express his deepest sympathies. Right. No wonder the boss seems grumpy. Can you blame <laughs> him? If it were up to Luddites like Taggart, you would have died on that operating table. The problem is, he knows how to play on people's fears. Tampering with human biology can be pretty scary. Tell that to all the war ants whose lives have been improved because of it. But if Taggart has his way, if he can sway popular opinion enough, then the United Nations will be forced to take a stand. Mark my words, that man is trouble. Any news? Niasia returns in triumph. Anti Octagon coming to Mulin Convention Center. Okay, you can pause it and read it there if you want. Anything else I can steal from you? No, that's your purse. <laughs> Oh, where is this? Oh, a bathroom. Is this ladies or gentlemen? It doesn't say, right? Oh, one is ladies and one is gentlemen. Let's see, because I found an ebook in one... In one of the... Can you... No, you can't... Uh, I don't, know. don't mind me if I take a peek. Maybe there are ebooks and stuff, you know. Yeah. Ah, I feel better now. Bye. I think I'm gonna go to my office. Uh, let me check. Okay. So we have two missions. Visit the clinic. Meet with Dr. Markovic. And investigating the... Suicide terrorist. Retrieve the dead terrorist near Al Hub. Okay. I think in the clinic we will be able to buy stuff. I have 4,000 credits. Follow me. So probably we can buy another net or something. I don't know. I guess augmentations for weapons. I don't think we have the clinic will be will be that. But first I wanna go to my office because we haven't visited yet. Okay, please report to my office. Really? That the the subtitles are so small. In the the cinematics, no, the the cutscenes looks fine. But uh, I'm recording at 2K, and my goodness, I can't see <laughs> a, a damn thing. Excuse me for a sec. All right, just checking uh, how long I'm recording and all that. So where is my? Adam Jensen, please report to your office. Oh, look at that. Adam Jensen. So it is in blue. So now we have side quest. The side quests are in, in, in blue. Paging Adam Jensen. Seems I've been paged to my office. Not sure why or by whom. But if I get a chance, I should probably swing to swing by to check it out. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. I want to go to my office anyway. Hello. I heard what happened at the plant with the hostages. Don't yeah. be too hard on yourself. We know you had your priorities. You are very understanding. I guess none of your friends uh, worked in there. Adam Jensen, please report to your office. 
My office. My beautiful office. Okay. Oh, who is this? This is nuts. What do you mean? Yes, well, this is nuts. Where, where are you? Hey, Jensen. In? Man, it's good to see you. I'm glad you're back. How are you holding up? I manage. I'm sorry about Megan. I know it must be hard. For a while, we thought you were a goner, too. Everything's going to shit. The attack on HQ, and now this mess with the factory. Yeah, tough times all around. How about you, Corella? You okay? I don't know. I... Uh, I fucked up. I mean bad. What happened? Well, a couple of months ago, me and Tyndall, you know, one of Pritchard's techs, we started sneaking out some neuropazine from one of the labs. Jesus, Tim. You realize this could get you fired, worse, arrested, if the company chooses to prosecute. What were you thinking? I know. It's just... it's complicated. I didn't want to do it at first, but there were good reasons. Anyway, now I want out, but Tyndall has security footage of me stealing the stuff and says he'll expose me if I ever stop helping him. I'm in a bad spot, Adam. I need that footage back. I know you're busy with everything that's going on right now, but I could really use your help. Neuropazine. What could you guys want with an anti-rejection drug for augmentation patients? Reselling it? Providing a competitor? Why do you automatically assume I was trying to turn a profit? Pretty ballsy stealing a patented drug from a secure lab. How'd you manage to do it? Both Tyndall and I worked the night shift every other week. I stashed the Neuropazine in a bag while he edited the security footage. Guess he kept part of it. Hey. How about Tyndall? Can't you reason with him? You could try, but Tyndall's a pretty driven guy. I mean, the guy's like a rock. You'd need a Casey Og or something to crack him. I got it covered. <laughs> what is it exactly you need me to do? I need you to get back that security footage Tyndall has on me. It's probably in his apartment. On his computer, maybe. So what? I just look him up in the phone book? His apartment is near Brooklyn Court. It might be tough to get in because his building has a large security gate protecting it. Well, that's just great. Hacking <laughs> the security gate is possible, but would require advanced hacking skills. I have them all. You might have to look around for an alternate path. Maybe use the fire escape or something. And I should care about this because... Damn, Adam. Are you really going to shake me down like this? That's cold. Nah. I'm hurting here. Look, I may be able to get my hands on a weapon mod for you. Jeez, never thought I'd have to buy your help. <laughs> nothing is... Uh, nothing is for free nowadays. Nowadays. And this is in the future, so even more, you know. Okay. All right. Tell me more. We want really? side quest. Wow. Thanks, Adam. I thought I was done for. The security footage will probably be on his apartment computer. Meet me in front of the subway station parking lot once you get a hold of it. I got it from here. Okay. Uh, and it's, it's gonna be on my... Here, right? Lesser evils. Team Carella, a researcher, has asked for help, da 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 da. In this apartment. Okay, I guess when I go to do this, I will I will have that. Uh, and I have all the inventory. So I'm holding that uh, weapon upgrade. I don't know uh, which weapon. I think I'm going to do it with the... Uh, okay. I think I, I'm going to do it with the pistol. Is this... Painkillers. This is probably my, my code. But you know what? I'm gonna hack my own computer. Because I, I this way we get more we get more XP. Yeah, security rating three, we have three attempts. 
This is level 3. Uh, okay, we can spam with that. What is this? 250 XP extra. 250 XP extra. Uh, but we have to get to here. So... Yeah, well, there's only one way to go. Okay, let's go. Quickly. Ten seconds. Oh! Granted. I didn't get the rewards. I did use one. The stop. I used one uh, one virus. Damn it! Minor security concern. Adam, I really don't mean to back you on this, but I think I've got another suspect in those neuroposine thefts. Who is this? Athen Magulis. I caught Denzel Mitchell going over my stack of Versa Life purchase orders. He said he needed to verify the legal. Ta -ta -ta. I caught Denzel Mitchell going over my stack of Versa Life. Denzel Mitchell? That's not one of these guys. For a lawyer, you think he'll be able to come up with a better defense? His door code is 1364, by the way. Uh, I think I'm gonna hack all the. Yeah, there is my login. <laughs> the passwords will also work on your home computer. Okay. Oh, what is this? Wine. Okay, that will give me. What is it? Wine. Gain an additional 10 health points to a maximum of 200. Use from the inventory, description, the Great Wall, Vineyards, blah blah blah. Attached from China, the Great Wall, Vineyards. Alcoholic beverages will imbue the drinker with a small increase in damage resistance. Each additional beverage consumed will increase this effect. Adverse effects will include boiler division. Okay, so if we consume it now, I have. 125 since I took that beer. Oh no, the painkillers. I have four beers already. So if I... What if I drink it? <laughs> okay, now it's 135. How long does this last though? I can't put... Uh, I can't take out, I can't put things... Oh, that's uh, that's fast. Not very fast. The blue vision doesn't last uh, at all, and I have more, more um, more. What is it called? There's someone here. Oh, yeah, there's someone here. Hello. Finally, someone who can get things done. Welcome back, Adam. Thank you. Let me see your ebook. Hearts of Steel. Okay, you can pause it and read it, guys. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm gonna pass the second page and I will read it afterwards. Because that's a ton of reading. Yeah. I don't think I have enough water on me. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just looking for things to steal. I increase my inventory. Anybody here? No. Team Carella. Hey, this is the guy, right? Let me. Uh, the quest. Is it? Oh, Tindals. Yeah, Team Carella. Let me hack this. Security rating 2. Uh. Detection analysis. From here to here to here. Oh, we need to get both though. And there are no rewards here. Okay. Um, 
Let's see, I wanna fortify my... My node. This is level 3, we are level 6 now. Okay, minus 2. So it, this randomly gives my plus and minus to different uh, nodes. Let's get this one. Only 15%. And this is the same, it's gonna give us plus and minus. Okay, now this now is uh, is higher. Three and three is the same. Let's get it before it gets higher. Okay, so that's it. With all the hack implants that Access I have. Granted. I'm the security chief, so this is his computer. I take your money. <laughs> and an ebook. The sleepwalking world. Again, I'm gonna you can I'm gonna pause. You can pause it. <laughs> And you can read it. I'm changing the page. Boom. And again, you can pause and read it. And let's see if we can hack in... Oh, what else do you have in there? Give me your money. You thief. <laughs> you thief. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, this is open. Tim Carella. What do you mean? He's... Uh, Brian Tyndall Package received, thanks See, next time though I think we'll need a new drop zone Not to make you nervous or anything But I'm pretty sure the geek who files the company Chopper saw, the, uh, saw me coming out of the helipad storage area After I grabbed it and That's uh, Malik uh, Tim Carella What do you mean she saw you? Christ, Brian uh, Knowing is not an option It could mean my job You gotta find out if she's on to me Hey man, I don't work there anymore. Richard fired me for messing with the IntelliCam footage, remember? So you'll have to get into her office and snoop around yourself. If you really want to be sure, all I can do is give you her office access code 5275 if she, wasn't, if she hasn't changed it. This is Malik. I don't know, Malik also will have an office. I'm out, B. I don't want to no, know. Ta ta ta. Are you deleting these emails, aren't you? You and since we can't use the helipad storage area anymore, I put the veils in the basement in a vent shaft. Oh, we found it. We. I don't know how you expect to collect them. Um. Yeah, we found them, guys. Okay, this is just uh, normal. Okay. So I actually, we already know where the the drugs are. I didn't know what drugs were because in in Deus Ex, the, the game from 2000, there were some vials. The I don't remember. I, I don't know if it's the same name of the drug, and uh, you could actually use it, and it will give you. Great job at the plant, boss. Wish I could have gone out with you, but things got a little tense over here too. Yeah, don't worry. I'm not just snooping around or anything. Okay, so maybe maybe we go. Who is this? Denzel Mitchell. Maybe we go because otherwise it's gonna be quite boring, right? For you guys, just watching me. Let's go to the next area and we will continue uh, reading all the all the computers later on. Here we go, Detroit! Down, down. Okay, give me the Tutorial. The objective screen details your current missions and objectives. In here, you can find extra information that may help you better understand what needs to be done. 
Missions can be activated or deactivated, depending on if you want them to appear in your radar or not. Deactivated missions can still be completed. Okay. Let, let's go. Think outside outside the, bo the box. The most obvious path is not always the best. Look for hidden paths. They might reward you in various ways. Yeah, the game really rewards you for going off the path. Takes longer though. Mrs. Reed? Oh, Adam, I'm sorry you startled me. And please, call me Cassandra. You and Megan were together long enough. I was waiting for you. Out here? Why not come meet me inside? I this is know. Megan's mother. I guess I'm just not ready. This is where you work, but to me, this is also the place where I lost my daughter. I know what you mean. It's never been the same for me either. I guess it's not meant to be easy. It seems there's just no right way to deal with something like this. And I can't even begin to imagine how things have been for you after all you've been through. Yeah. A lot of things changed six months ago. I can't get over how much they've changed you. At first, I couldn't even believe you were still alive. How do you handle all of this? Uh, I just got a bottle of wine. <laughs> I, they did what they had to do to save me. I do what I have to do, augmented or not. I never asked for this. I never asked for this. Uh, they did what they had to do to save me. And in a way, I can do more now than I ever could. I'm glad to know you take it so well. Many of us wouldn't be able to cope so easily with such traumatic changes. Can I ask why you wanted to see me? Yes, of course. I'm sorry. I'm here about Megan. About what happened to her. Or rather, about the investigation into what happened. What about it? Well, simply put, I feel something is not quite right with the way the case was handled. You think there was some foul play involved? I do. Call it mother's intuition. But when speaking to some of the investigators, there were a lot of inconsistencies. And then I met this detective, a man called Chase. He agreed detective things Chase. weren't handled by the book, although he has no proof. And now you want to find out more? I'll never hear my daughter laugh again, Adam. I'll never get a call from her to ask how I've been, or have the chance to ask her about her day. She was stolen from me. However unjustified this all is, I still want to know why it happened. I can see why she loved you. Not even that degree of mechanical modification could change what she saw in you. Please, will you help me find out what really happened to her? Of course. Reward. I'm not even gonna ask for a reward to her mother. I never got a chance to investigate the attack myself. I'll look into it. Thank you. This means the world to me, Adam. Really. The first thing I'll need to do is meet with this detective, Chase. Good. He works part-time as a security guard in an apartment building on Brooklyn Court. Oh. I'll be waiting for you in your apartment lobby once you're done. Why does a detective need to work part-time as a security guard? Oh, he retired soon after the case. I don't really know the details. Maybe he'll tell you more. I'm on it. I bet you it's gonna be the same building that we have to get, uh, go to the apartment of... Uh... Ah, maybe not. What is that? You can search the trash cans? And I found money? <laughs> really? Mr. Oh. Jensen, is it true that the leader of the terrorist cell got away? Guess you weren't as ready as Mr. Sarah thought. Are you playing with a Steam Deck? That didn't exist when this game came out? <laughs> I'm sorry, I, I really can't talk right now, Mr. Jensen. I'm still in shock over what happened at the Sarah plant. Enjoy your coffee, eh? What are you doing behind my back? 
Jansen, right? I've heard about you. Yeah, you were a good cop by most accounts. But you're lucky you got out. Why? Look at the force now. Our badges mean nothing. We've got no authority. Look at the force now. Our badges mean nothing. We've got no authority. Come on, man. Oh, you have a... Uh, impressive uh, gun with you. You take uh, the Detroit PD. I don't really have anything against it. Man, I this town is dead. Special. I should have just moved I mean, Philadelphia. Grafting <laughs> meddling to your skin. Hey, you seem nice and all, but I'm really not interested. I don't really have anything What, you don't want to try my augmented thing? <laughs> you know who's behind these attacks yeah. on Sarah Industries, don't, don't you? Tattoos. It's not the same. People who fake you don't need to take drugs for the rest of your life. I'm sorry. We're having a private conversation here. It's yeah, not the it's same. it's very private. You don't need to take drugs for the rest of your life when you have a tattoo. Well, I think we Did you see that? Holy cow! Did did you see that? I didn't know we had that. Why did you do it? You were beautiful just the way you were. Oh yeah, but I was gonna die. Yeah. I would have been a beautiful corpse. I just look at every corner, you know, guys. If you see me I play. But I think the people who choose to augment themselves are rejecting their own humanity. I didn't, I didn't ask for this. <laughs> Welcome to the Detroit Automated Information Network, including directory assistance, tourist information, and street quest. Can we use this? Services are temporarily offline. Oh, they're Thank offline. You. Look at the cars, guys. Wow. This is from 2011, huh? the, the game, with well, the original. This is the direct, director's cut, which is from 2013. Hey, man. Imagine. William Taggart, right here in Detroit. What a great man. I know some people question his motivation, but I think he's only looking out for the little people. The little people. Oh, look at the alleys. So let, let me let's have a look at the map. You are here, and we are on the. On the opposite side that we have to go to. Jensen. Okay, so that's the. Oh, Sarif Quarters is here. I don't know where is that, but I guess we can't access now. The Limb Clinic is there, that's closed. Let's check this alley because it's, we're already there. Police station and the morgue. Downtown apartments. So first we're going to go to the Lim Clinic. And then we're going to do these side missions. And finally we do this. Derelict row. All right, let's check in here. Can I use weapons if I choose to? Oh, yes. Okay. Uh, better keep them hold, uh, holstered in case. Uh, hey, who are you? I got a right to live my life as I choose, and this little corner of the universe here is mine. Okay, sorry for stepping in your corner of the universe. Hey, there's probably something here. Come. I oh, know you already took it. <laughs> hey. But I found another another beer. Okay. God bless America, man. Yes. God bless America, man. <laughs> I'm Spanish, but uh, doesn't matter. All the games, movies, uh, etc., are all based in uh, USA. And God bless the uh, computer games. Hey, Adam, didn't see you there. You heading home for the evening, or does Mr. Seraph have you looking into something new? Where are you playing? Adam! Hey! Nice look you got going on there. You must be hitting the clubs tonight. Oh, yeah. You wanna come? Hello. I really should have stayed in bed this morning. Missed the bus home and the subway is shut down. I swear, if it isn't one thing, it's another. 
Mm, yes. I swear, if it isn't one okay. thing, it's another. All right, so everybody has something no more to... No rest for the weary in this city, I guess. <laughs> Can't talk about it. Right. Well, just take care of yourself. Thank you. Uh, we already checked there. What do you think of the map, guys? Oh, look at that! Ten year old game. What is that? Oh, that's something there. How do I get there? Can I jump here? Yes, I can. Okay, let's run. And yeah, baby. Wow, look at that. A ton of money. Well, thirteen forty nine. And 87. Better than nothing. Who throws the credits to the garbage? Anyway. I hope I can get out of here now. Yes, I can. Because I have an augmentation. Oh, this moves uh, sometimes the, the frames, right? Where is this? Oh, the newspaper. Biohazard bomb triggered at Sarif Manufacturing Plant. Now everybody knows... Anti out terrorist at large. Sex Sanders, and everybody knows his him. Okay. So, where are we? You are here. No, we want to go to the limb clinic over there. Hey. Keep that weapon holstered, sir. We've had enough action for one night. It is holstered. It is. It was holstered. Have a good night, sir. Uh, shut up. Oh, this is newspaper again, right? Yes. Uh, hey. You know who's behind these attacks on Seraph Industries, don't you? Same people who faked 9-11. Oh, you must be a friend of they the other guy. They want scared man. They want every person in the Western world terrified some terrorists going to attack us in our homes. Be careful with your cigarette. Hey, another beer. You know what? I'm gonna have I'm gonna have some beers. What the heck? Uh you said. A little blurred, uh, we are at 140. So I can keep using them to get my health up to 200. I'm gonna do it. Uh, what is it? Eight, right? No, seven is the beer. Seven. Have another beer. 145. And another one. And another one. I'm gonna drink them all. I'm a little, I'm a little tipsy. <laughs> ah, yes, tipsy. Detroit Opera House. Il Metamorfoso. Do I have more? No, I drunk them all. <laughs> but it doesn't last very long. And look at the benefits. You get all that extra health. No trouble tonight, right? Just give me an excuse. What an asshole. Okay, here is the clinic. Where is that? Oh, <laughs> this is the. Uh, what about you? Keep that weapon holstered, sir. It is holstered. Shut up. I'd advise you to stay away from the DRB gang if you can. Uh, yes. Where, what, why? Just stay in the brightly lit streets and you'll be fine. Someone is getting rich while the rest of us are suffering. I wouldn't know. You look like you're built for trouble. <laughs> I wouldn't know about those things. Listen, just because you have money doesn't make you better than me. I wouldn't know about those things. Sorry, bud. The protest broke up hours ago. There's nothing to see here anymore. I wouldn't know about it. I'm sure the protest. evening news will tell you everything you want to know. Okay. I wouldn't know about I'm those sorry things. to disturb you. I I'm just uh, curious. Well, I guess the question now. Mm -hmm. Remember to use nutrients to replenish your energy. Hello. Ah, 
Mr. Jensen, David Serov told me you'd be dropping by. I've just been reviewing the test results we received on you last week. Should I start rolling up my sleeves? Surprisingly, no. I see no trace of glial tissue buildup in any of your charts. It's been six months, Doc. Shouldn't I be on neuropazine shots by now? One would think, but these test results show no signs of implant rejection. If anything, the bond between tissue and electrodes seems to be getting stronger. So I'm free to go? Well, Mr. Serif did ask me to discuss another topic with you. You are aware that several precautionary measures had to be put into place during your first surgery? Not all of my implants were switched on, I know. The damage caused by the hematoma had to be taken into account. Your brain needed time to recover, to get used to the mechanical neural processors and turn them on naturally over time. Cut to the chase, Doc. What does Seraph want? <laughs> he feels that you might be ready to speed up the activation process using special software known as Praxis Kits. You mean I don't have to wait for my augmentations to kick in naturally anymore? You can, if you prefer. But Mr. Seraph did make a generous donation to Lim in your name thus ensuring that Praxis software linked to your particular neuro enhancements would always be available to you and you alone. Please, take a look. 5,000 credits! Dr. LeBlanc, okay, so now we have 10,000 credits. Ah, we... so they have ammunition also! Hypo, hypo steam. What the heck is this? Gain a temporary increase of 50 health points up to a maximum of 200. Use from the inventory. So, like a med kit. Uh, what this is useful? Only 100. General augmentations. Oh, a praxis kit. 5000. Buying this item will automatically increase your Praxis Point Counter. A software package that allows you to directly download knowledge. Okay. So I could buy two, and then I couldn't buy anything else. Uh, Pro Energy Jar. But this is for the... Replenish three energy cells in full. Use from inventory. But this is we, like what we have. But this is three. Wow. And ammunition. Oh, Typhoon ammo. Kill enemies in a 360 degree arc. Prerequisite Typhoon explosive system augmentation. A pack of 10 millimeters gauge in stainless steel. Ta -ta 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 -ra 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 -ra. Uh, do I have it now? I'm gonna buy. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna buy also this. And I'm gonna buy. How much does it give you? 50 extra health points. I'm gonna buy a couple. And I'm gonna buy one Praxis point. One Praxis kit. I still have 4,000. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's sold out. What about this? Sold out. Okay. Very well, Mr. Jensen. Use it in good health. To OR. Dr. To oh. OR. oh, I can't use the... Hey, hello. Nice jacket. I bet you're hiding some real cutting-edge enhancements under it, aren't you? Yeah, a nice dish or two. My ex-boyfriend was a pro-human purist. The bastard. Dumped his ass as soon as I figured out what he was. <laughs> My ex-boyfriend was a pro-human purist. Okay. The bastard. My first surgery. Dumped his ass as soon as it's I figured out what it was. But you gotta look at it as an investment in the future. My first surgery. It's expensive, oh, but shit. you gotta look at it as an investment. Did you get those hands through the MAP? Oh, I thought he was preacher. They must be Seraph made, right? Or are they Thai Young Medical? They look awesome. They must be Seraph made, right? Or okay. Are they Thai so. Young medical? What else is here? I've never been under anesthesia before. 
Augmentations. Can I be here? Wow. Sorry, I was just looking at that scar on your head. More or less. If you're here for some work, please go to the counters. More or less. If you're here for some work, please go to the counters. Did you get that before? More or less. This is my first visit. I'm a little nervous. More or less. I know it sounds a little hair raising, but we do it every day, several times over. It's a very safe. Hey, an ebook. The Visual Cortex 2.0, the AI redesign. Again, we can. I got a scholar or something. You can pause it and you can read it. But you might afterward as you wake up. And again. I think we need to come here later, uh, like in a mission, <laughs> stealthily, I mean. I have flashbacks, but I haven't played this game in eight years, guys, so you already know if you have watched any of the other episodes. And here's where you get all the implants. It's, it's not uh, closed. Vera Markovic, I believe you have me construct me. Okay, you... You wrote. Go to the beginning. Mrs. Margulis, of course, I appreciate Mr. Self's support, which is why to my best to explain to my patient exactly what this generous gift entails. But that is as far as I will go. From now on, whenever augmentations he decides to acquire will be his choice, and his alone. The patient, and not the employer, will be the one to decide whether a half tested prototype augmentation should be included with all the others or not. Give your patient some general medical advice. That that's me. Uh, when they arrive, treat them with courtesy. What is that? An anticipation from the World Health Organization, the Limb Clinic. Oh, the inspection. Adam Jensen, blood, ta, ta, ta. no allergies, family history unknown, adopted age five, no papers. Has demonstrated healing ability greater than two standard deviations above the mean of the, in the following. A speed of recovery, repossession of faculties, post-traumatic memory retention, and usually large quantities of NGF appearing around implementation sites. Unique autoimmune disorder may indicate he will not require neuropothine injections anytime soon. One previous operation six months ago, life critical, requiring full replacement of chest cavity and left arm. Right arm and legs replaced at behest of employer. Authority granted under terms of employment contract. Oh shit. So uh, the chest and one arm had to be replaced to survive. But then the right arm and the legs was because he, Sarif, chose to, to, to do it. Recovery speed being unknown at the time. Patient was also... Uh, Refitted with PEDOT. <laughs> Biochips in all areas of possible neuroprosthetic uh, insertion to reduce need for physiotherapy following any subsidies in general. So it was Sarif who chose to uh, to put everything on us. Okay. Was there something there besides the. No. Okay, let's go, let's go. Protesting is not against the law. I know that, officer. But some of those guys were carrying tire irons and setting garbage cans on fire. And those were the ones we arrested. The rest were merely exercising their right to free speech. What about my right to come to work each day without fearing for my life? I've still got to walk home tonight. I understand your concern. But if you want round-the-clock protection, I suggest you hire a private security company. <laughs> Sorry. But I'm in the middle of something. I see. If you saw what happened and want to make a report, drop by the precinct. People see conspiracies everywhere. They're saying that Lim's personal catalogs mean some people get preferential treatment. Please. Lim are the good guys. They believe in equality, unlike everybody else. That's what everybody says. Everybody is the, the good guys.